an asteroid hurtling towards the Earth is something real-life scientists are preparing for at NASA. Oumuamua is so weird, I wish it never existed. We would have the power to tell you when you would die and what part of Earth it would hit. NASA has dropped a bombshell revelation that has sent shockwaves throughout the globe. Oumuamua, the mysterious object discovered in 2017, is now heading for a destructive collision with Earth. In the next five days, we are set to face one of the greatest space threats from this unexpected visitor, leaving us more perplexed about its true nature and possible danger to our planet. What exactly is Oumuamua, and why has its impending collision with Earth sparked such intense interest and concern? Most importantly, what potential hazards does Oumuamua's collision with Earth pose? And what measures are being taken to mitigate any risks? Join us to learn more as NASA announces Oumuamua will impact Earth in five days, and it's not stopping. From the beginning of time, people have always wondered what lies beyond the universe and if we are alone in the vast cosmos of space. This question has remained unanswered and has been passed down to our present generation. While everyone has their theories, there is no substantial evidence to back them up. However, everything changed on a cold night in 2017 when what seemed like an alien ship entered our cosmic radar. This mysterious object, later dubbed Oumuamua, appeared suddenly in the sky. And before we could get enough data, it disappeared into the depths of outer space. This marks the first time an object from space has been observed visiting our solar system. Given our advanced knowledge of the cosmos and technology, identifying and categorizing this mysterious object should have been a simple task. However, Oumuamua appears to be full of questions that elude us. Oumuamua, meaning the messenger from afar, has confused scientists and astronomers alike. This strange object is believed to have traveled from the depths of space, from a region beyond our solar system. While it's not uncommon for interstellar objects to occasionally enter Earth's solar system, Oumuamua's unexpected visit has left us confused. Scientists were initially intrigued by Oumuamua's peculiar features. From the lens of an observing telescope, it was seen to have an elongated shape resembling a sausage or cigar. This shape was entirely different from the usual rounded or irregular shapes of asteroids commonly found orbiting the Sun within our solar system. As such, many believe Oumuamua bears the signs of a carefully developed or engineered object. Due to Oumuamua's unconventional orbit pattern, which defied the norms observed in asteroids, the theory of its extraterrestrial origin continued to gain ground. As Oumuamua defied conventional explanations with its extraordinary characteristics, it swiftly became a subject of controversy. Among those intrigued by the mystery surrounding this celestial anomaly are Avi Loeb, an Israeli-American theoretical physicist and published author. Carrying out a private investigation into the mysteries surrounding Oumuamua, Loeb also believes Oumuamua to be of extraterrestrial origin. Unfortunately, Oumuamua's quick departure from our solar system didn't allow further examination. Now, to everyone's surprise, Oumuamua has resurfaced, traveling toward Earth at a fascinating speed. If it maintains its course and speed, NASA believes Oumuamua could make a direct impact on Earth within five days. But could it slow down and change direction like its first trip toward Earth? Upon Oumuamua first arrival in our solar system, it immediately defied the norms of conventional space travel. Generally, space objects move at consistent speeds relative to other celestial bodies. However, scientists quickly realized that Oumuamua was traveling at its own unique speed. At first glance, some scientists even thought it was a comet. Comets are icy bodies in space that develop tails as volatile materials 
vaporize off their surfaces due to the sun's intense heat. If you've ever witnessed a dazzling ball of light streaking across the night sky, chances are you observed a comet. Unlike asteroids or planetary bodies, comets can reach speeds of up to 100,000 miles per hour, depending on their distance from the sun. As such, Oumuamua's remarkable speed made scientists think it was a comet. However, it lacked a critical feature of most comets, the escaping tail gas. Oumuamua's peculiar movement through space did not resemble that of a typical comet. Some researchers theorized that it might be expelling gas from its sunlit side, propelling it like a rocket. However, upon closer examination, this theory faced a significant obstacle. There was a lack of detectable escaping gas and consequently, a tail. If Oumuamua were indeed a comet, scientists would have been able to confirm it. Even as an interstellar object, it would have displayed some common characteristics. This was the case in 2019, when an interstellar comet named 2i Borisov was discovered. This comet behaved like a typical rogue comet, exhibiting a tail 14 times the size of Earth. Unlike Oumuamua, it has been fragmented multiple times over the years. With Oumuamua turning out to be neither an asteroid nor a comet, a new theory emerged. It could be a fragment from an exoplanet. This theory suggested that an asteroid had collided with a planet outside our solar system, sending fragments traveling through space. However, this theory also lacked enough evidence. From the moment Oumuamua was first observed on October 19, 2017, using the PANSTARS-1 observatory in Hawaii, it became a captivating mystery. The PANSTARS-1 observatory is an acronym for Panoramic Survey Telescope and Rapid Response System. It houses a huge telescope equipped with one of the world's largest digital cameras, boasting 1.4 billion pixels. The observatory's primary purpose is to identify potential threats to Earth, primarily objects that could collide with our planet and cause damage. When astronomers operating the telescope spotted the strange object moving through our solar system, they concluded it was something enigmatic and named it Oumuamua. Astronomers initially believed Oumuamua resembled a tumbling sausage-shaped object. However, its true form was revealed days after it passed through our solar system. Measurements indicated that Oumuamua had dimensions of 377 by 364 by 62 feet, disproving the initial cigar-like shape and revealing a pancake-like structure. As Oumuamua approached its closest point to the sun on September 9, 2017, it exhibited astonishing speed, traveling approximately 196,000 miles per hour. Furthermore, its orbital trajectory around the sun suggested that gravitational forces did not influence it. Above all, it was discovered to have been traveling from far beyond our solar system. The idea of an alien presence exploring our solar system with Oumuamua caused controversy and panic within the scientific community and the general public. Oumuamua's propulsion appeared to surpass the forces typically observed in comets or other celestial bodies, exhibiting a continuous deliberate push. It seemed to accelerate as it looked to escape the sun's heat and return to its extraterrestrial home. These features led many to entertain the idea that Oumuamua was an alien spacecraft. Theories suggested it could be an extraterrestrial probe, similar to our Voyager spacecraft, but instead of conventional fuel, it was powered by an unknown internal energy source. Determining the origin and age of Oumuamua presented a significant challenge. Due to its extremely high velocity, Obtaining a live sample or a close-up view of the object was impossible. At the same time, Earth-based telescopes lacked the necessary resolution to capture a clear image. Consequently, scientists initially concluded that Oumuamua had a cigar-like shape, a 
until later observations confirmed its pancake-like structure. The alien spaceship theory gained ground, as it seemed to be the most plausible explanation for this strange celestial situation. Some researchers even share alien explanations for Oumuamua's origin and operation. Avi Loeb, a Harvard professor of astronomy, proposed that Oumuamua was an alien spacecraft equipped with a light sail for space propulsion. This method involves using the sun's radiation as a source of propulsion. According to Loeb, photons bounce off Oumuamua's surface, generating energy for movement. However, this theory faced many flaws. Solar radiation can only propel tiny, lightweight objects with low densities, requiring a large surface area to capture sufficient radiation for propulsion. Nevertheless, if we consider a civilization far more advanced than our own, these limitations may not apply. As such, it is possible that solar radiation could power a spacecraft the size of Oumuamua, even without visible solar sails. Despite the excitement surrounding the alien spacecraft theory, the mysteries surrounding Oumuamua remain. The scientific community remained cautious and skeptical. Extraordinary claims require extraordinary evidence, and without concrete proof or direct observation, the hypothesis of Oumuamua being an alien spacecraft remains speculative at best. Scientists will always follow the principle of Occam's razor, which suggests that the simplest explanation is often the most likely. In the case of Oumuamua, the simplest explanation would be a natural, unusual object rather than an alien spacecraft. To gather more information about Oumuamua and potentially solve the mystery of its origin and nature, scientists turned to advanced computer simulations and modeling. Researchers analyzed the available data and ran various simulations to recreate and understand Oumuamua's trajectory and behavior. These simulations offered valuable insights into the object's possible composition, shape, and potential origins. But there's still more to learn. In October 2018, a study published in the Astrophysical Journal Letters proposed a plausible natural explanation for Oumuamua. The researchers suggested that the object could be a fractal dust aggregate formed in the protoplanetary disk around a young star. Such aggregates are composed of dust particles that clump together due to electrostatic forces, forming a loosely bound structure. This explanation would account for Oumuamua's unusual shape and lack of a visible tail. While the natural explanation gained support in the scientific community, the possibility of Oumuamua being an artificial object or spacecraft remained captivating. The Breakthrough Listen project, which aims to search for evidence of extraterrestrial intelligence, even conducted a comprehensive search for artificial signals from Oumuamua. However, no evidence of artificial signals or any other indications of extraterrestrial technology was detected. As time passed and Oumuamua moved farther away from our solar system, it became increasingly challenging to gather additional data. Eventually, it became too faint and distant to observe effectively, leaving many questions unanswered. Oumuamua, the mysterious object originating from far beyond our solar system, continues to perplex scientists as they look to learn its true origin. Initially, experts speculated that Oumuamua may have come from Vega, a brilliantly luminous star within the Lyra constellation. Vega's collection of debris disks made it a likely candidate for the origin of Oumuamua. According to this hypothesis, Oumuamua would have embarked on an astonishing 60,000-year journey to reach our solar system. However, recent developments have cast doubt on the Vega theory, leading scientists to explore a wide range of alternative possibilities. Some scientists now suggest that Oumuamua may have traveled our galaxy for billions of years,
passing through over 20,000 star systems. This means its journey has likely spanned hundreds of thousands of years. While this may seem like a huge time frame, it is relatively small compared to the galaxy's age, estimated to be around 10 billion years old, with over 200 billion stars. Given the duration of Oumuamua's interstellar journey, astronomers speculate that its encounter with our solar system may mark its first interaction with a new stellar region. This theory gains support from Oumuamua's trajectory, which closely resembles the movement of neighboring stars as they rapidly pass by our Sun. To unlock the secrets of Oumuamua's origin, scientists have carefully retraced its path before it entered our solar system. Corin Baylor-Jones of the Max Planck Institute for Astronomy undertook the challenging task of analyzing Oumuamua's course in relation to the historical positions of approximately 7 million stars. By using data from the Gaia spacecraft, which diligently monitored these stars, Baylor-Jones reconstructed their orbital paths and searched for intersections or similarities with Oumuamua's travel path. This extensive investigation yielded four promising candidates, each exhibiting trajectories that closely resembled the re-established path of Oumuamua. Among these candidates, one is believed to be Oumuamua's origin. However, conclusively determining its origin remains a complex challenge. During his thorough examination, Baylor-Jones made an intriguing observation. He noticed that Oumuamua's travel path aligned with a region between 1 and 2 Oort cloud radius, or 100,000 to 200,000 astronomical units. Additionally, the encounter velocities between Oumuamua and each of the potential origin candidates were remarkably high, ranging from 6 to 16 miles per hour, posing a serious puzzle for scientists. Some researchers have proposed that Oumuamua could be a planetesimal, a building block expelled during the early stages of planet formation. However, achieving such exceptional ejection velocities solely through encounters with larger planets seems highly impossible, though not entirely impossible. Another possibility is that Oumuamua originated from a binary star system, which could account for its substantial velocity. However, none of the four most likely candidates for Oumuamua's origin are binary stars, further adding to the complexity of the puzzle. The search for Oumuamua's true birthplace continues, with the hope that more Gaia data will shed light on this cosmic mystery. Additional data from Gaia will enable astronomers to refine their search for the celestial traveler's origin, providing deeper insights into the motions of neighboring stars and potentially leading to more conclusive results. However, Aside from its origin, one question remains, what propelled Oumuamua through the vastness of space, separating it from its celestial home? Scientists have proposed several intriguing possibilities to explain the rapid journey of this enigmatic interstellar visitor. One hypothesis suggests that Oumuamua may have formed as a result of a cataclysmic collision between two celestial bodies. Another theory proposes that a supernova explosion could have shot Oumuamua from its original location, making it the first messenger from distant realms to grace our solar system. Some even likened Oumuamua to a messenger of calamity, similar to wandering asteroids that pose potential threats to Earth in the future. However, the narrative becomes even more captivating when astronomers like Garrett Levine of Yale University present a compelling idea. The idea states that Oumuamua might consist of fragments of ice expelled from the rocky disks of far-flung planets. Now, they routinely find their way into our solar system as interstellar debris. In 2017, Project Lyra was launched as an initiative inspired by Oumuamua. The primary goal is to develop a spacecraft capable of traveling at high speeds, 
to intercept interstellar objects like Oumuamua and 2i slash Borisov. The project aimed to achieve this by using an innovative light sail spacecraft. The Lyra project is projected to launch a dedicated spacecraft between 2030 and 2033, which is expected to reach Oumuamua by 2047 or 2049. The realization of this ambitious endeavor is within reach due to significant advancements and innovations in spacecraft technology. For example, the Light Sail 2, a remarkably small spacecraft powered solely by solar radiation, has completed 18,000 orbits around Earth, covering a distance of 8 million kilometers. This spacecraft can propel tiny probes swiftly through space by reflecting high-powered lasers off its small sails. With further advancements in these types of spacecraft, we may develop a vessel fast enough to reach Oumuamua in the near future. However, recent observations suggest that we may not need to embark on a mission to Oumuamua after all, as it appears to be on a trajectory toward Earth. Although Oumuamua is currently located near the planet Neptune, there is concern that its unusual orbiting pattern may result in its return to Earth. If this were to occur, various possibilities and implications would arise. It is important to note that we still have limited knowledge about the nature of this object and the full extent of its capabilities. Further research and observation are essential to understanding and preparing for any potential interactions with Oumuamua. As things stand, even the chief of the Pentagon's UFO office has openly acknowledged the existence of an extraterrestrial mothership within our solar system. This lends credibility to the idea that Oumuamua might be a probe craft sent to observe Earth. Moreover, the idea that these otherworldly beings might be deploying microscopic probes to systematically investigate other celestial bodies similar to our own space missions adds another layer of fascination. In a recent study, Sean Michael Kirkpatrick, director of the Pentagon's All Domain Anomaly Resolution Office, corroborated Harvard professor Avi Loeb's findings. Loeb's stance remains that Oumuamua is an extraterrestrial spacecraft designed by an advanced alien civilization. However, this theory faces strong opposition from other scientists who argue that the vast astronomical distances involved render interstellar space missions impractical. Additionally, skeptics point out the absence of detectable radio signals from Oumuamua during previous scans. Nevertheless, it is worth considering that the lack of signals may be a deliberate attempt by the extraterrestrial beings to remain hidden. Meanwhile, some scientists still wonder if this mysterious object is a cosmic message, urging humanity to explore the universe further and expand our understanding. They ponder whether Oumuamua might even be a test designed to assess our technological and scientific progress. When Oumuamua briefly appeared in our solar system, the scientific community swiftly united, showcasing their collaborative capabilities and resource sharing. This event served as a valuable lesson. It reminded us to be prepared to interpret any encoded messages or signals embedded within such objects in future encounters with interstellar visitors. Oumuamua's sudden presence ignited the curiosity and thirst for knowledge of astronomers, astrophysicists, and researchers worldwide. It served as a universal call to action, reminding us of the vastness and intricacy of the universe and inspiring us to unite in our pursuit of understanding. If Oumuamua does indeed prove to be an alien spaceship, its ability to rapidly accelerate as it approaches the sun when exiting our solar system raises intriguing possibilities. If this object is piloted by extraterrestrial beings, it could potentially travel at tremendous speeds, allowing it to reach Earth in the shortest time possible. 
So what happens if Oumuamua impacts Earth? Well, the first consequence would be a catastrophic impact. The collision of this space object with Earth would cause widespread destruction, including landslides, mudslides, and other devastating effects. If Oumuamua is indeed a spaceship, we could potentially face a space invasion scenario. The implications of such an event are uncharted territory and could be profound. We cannot predict the diseases, pathogens, or deadly viruses that these aliens might bring with them. They may even possess a civilization with technologies far more advanced than ours, similar to what we see in science fiction movies. While all of this is purely speculative, we cannot dismiss these possibilities, especially considering that a respected scientist firmly believed that Oumuamua is indeed an alien spacecraft. On the other hand, if it turns out to be a mere space rock or fragment of a destroyed planet, our concern would be cleaning up the mess after the collision. Thanks for watching another episode of Voyager. While you're still here, make sure to click the video on your screen for more mind-blowing videos like this one.